Hello friends, welcome back to Tech Freak Gamers. And wow, what a week it was. The AMD has now risen. Yes, we saw the release of AMD's new processor lineup, the Ryzen 7. They have released three variants as of now, the 1700, the 1700X and the 1800X. Before we gush into the exciting first AMD Ryzen 8 core high-end VR ready gaming PC build, I would like to share a little about the new lineup of the processors. So AMD Ryzen's three variants are all 8 core and 16 thread processors with 14 nm pins, coming with all the new exciting Sense MI and XFR technologies. They are already shattering the benchmarks of Intel's high-priced i7 processors. This time AMD has lived up to the hype and expectations of its fans and has really turned the tides around. I have also come across various posts about Ryzen's heating issues. So let me put it in this way. With i7's 4 core and 8 threaded processors, the average temperature while casual gaming were somewhere in between 60 to 75 degrees. And since AMD's Ryzen 7 series comes with 8 cores and 16 threads, and also some really exciting features such as Sense MI keeping XFR away from this heating discussion, it is obvious that there will be some heating issues. So my verdict on Ryzen's processor is if you wish to go with 95 port 1700X or 1800X then get a cooling system upgraded. Now also here is another one or two things which you might get confused with. AMD's Ryzen benchmarks are all over the internet. Although we see the true computing and encoding power of this processor are breaking records, but the gaming performance are not quite as much as expected. What I have found is the gaming performance of, this pro of these processors, I'm sorry, when compared with the Intel's processors at the same range is better. However, when compared with Intel's processors which are higher in prices, more like high-end, these processors might not meet the expectations. So my target while making this PC was to give you the best performance in the price range. Now let's cut the weight and drive into this exciting AMD's Ryzen build. Now spoilers, this is a very high-end dream gaming PC and will cost you up to Rs. 1,50,000 and also includes gaming cabinet and cooling system. To begin with, we have chosen the AMD's Ryzen 7 1700X processor. This is an 8 core processor with 16 thread. Now this comes, uh, uh, comes with a base clock speed of 3.4 GHz and a boost clock speed of 3.8 GHz. It has all the AMD's promised perks like Sense MI which is to make your everyday tasks easier and the much talked XFR or extended frequency range with which your processor will push its limits automatically if your cooling system and motherboard allows it to. Now this is priced in India market at Rs 30,500. For motherboard, we have chosen the MSI's B350 Tomahawk, AM4 and 7th gen Athlon processor supporting motherboard. Now this can support DDR4 memory overclocked up to 3200 MHz. This is also SLI or Crossfire compatible and a VR ready motherboard. So no doubt one of the best options for future proofing your rig. This is also tested by eSports gamers up to 24 hour offline gaming. Now, this is available in our market at Rs. 12,000. For graphics card, when we talk about dream gaming PC builds, there are a few options for choosing a graphics card. And no doubt, the mighty NVIDIA GTX 1080 DDR5 8GB graphics card is always at the top of the list. So we have made no compromise with it. This is undoubtedly the best in class graphics card and can run any games at ultra settings. And I'm certain if you are spending such a hefty amount for your gaming PC, you are not targeting 1080 pixels. And even if we talk about 1440 or Ultra HD gaming, GTX 1080 can pull it all off. This MSI GTX 1080 DDR5 8GB Oshi edition will cost you around 59,000. For RAM, we have paired the Corsair Vengeance 2 8GB DDR4 RAMs, which comes with unlocked 3200 MHz clock speed. 
since with the best setup we can't ignore the aesthetic side of the PC so this RAM also comes with blue or white LED variant now you know what they say with great power comes even greater looks you can find this RAM at a total cost of rupees 10,800 for two of them next is hard disk and we have chosen the Western Digital's 2TB Black 7200 RPM variant. This hard disk is a beast with its unmatched performance. And moreover, with a brand name as Western Digital is, nothing can go wrong. This will cost you around Rs 9800. For power supply unit or SMPS, we have decided to power this setup with Antex HCG900. This is a 900 watt fully modular 80 plus bronze certified power supply unit. To stand in between the life and death of your dream PC, who else can we trust apart from the Antec? Now this power supply unit will cost you around Rs 9000. A dream PC without a cooling system? Nah. Hence, we have paired this setup with Corsair's Hydro Series H110i GT liquid cooling system. This comes with 280mm radiator and dual SP140L PWM fans to provide the excellent heating dissipation. And trust me when I say this, with such a wonderful cooling system, heating will no longer be a problem. This is priced at Rs 9000 in Indian market. Now, being a dream PC, it should look like one as well. So why compromise on the cabinet? We have chosen the all-time favorite NZXT Noctis 450 Black Edition. Now, this is one of the most beautiful mid-tower cabinet I have ever come across. It comes with three 120mm FN V2 fans and one 140mm FN V2 fan included in the bundle. It can also support up to 240mm or 320mm radiators in the front panel, 240mm or 320mm radiators at the top panel and one 140 or 120mm radiator at the back panel. Now, this is priced at Rs 11,000 in Indian market. So this entire setup will cost you around Rs 1,50,000. With this setup, you can play any game at ultra settings and you can also run VR ready games without any performance issues. Moreover, for the unlookers, I am sure they will be spellbound by the looks since this is a system to fall in love with. So guys, if you like this video, please hit the like button and please, please, please subscribe to my channel. And for more reviews and updates, please visit my website www techfreak-gamers.com With this, I take my leave. We'll see you soon in my next video. Till then, bye-bye and take care.